I'll be speaking on vessel unto honor. Vessel unto honor. If you are a vessel unto honor, God will keep touching you. Now, as as far as God is, you know, as long as God is touching you, your strength will be renewed. Because a vessel unto honor is close to God. God can pick that vessel at any time. What's the difference between a vessel unto honor and a vessel unto dishonor? A vessel unto honor is that honor that God can use at any time. Not just that, a vessel unto honor is that honor, is that vessel that is yielded to God, that is obedience to God. But a vessel unto dishonor is that vessel that God cannot use at will. A vessel that is disobedient, that is not yielded to the instructions of God, is a vessel unto dishonor. Meanwhile, both of them are vessels, meaning God can use the two of them. Are you getting what I'm saying? You see, the, the, the question here is not God is using me, but God is using me. That's not it. God can be using you, but the question is, has what vessel? Because both vessels will be used by God. That's the truth. But the kingdom of God is not for vessels unto dishonor. It's for vessels unto honor. It's for honorable vessels, not dishonored um, vessels. So God is using me is not enough. As what vessel? Is it as a vessel unto honor or as a vessel unto dishonor? So don't deceive yourself by God is using me. We know God has used you. We know God is still using you. But the question is, as what vessel? There are people that got miracle under your administration. Some people even gave their life to Christ. It's fine. But the question is, as what vessel? A man can disobey God, and in that disobedience, people can still be blessed. In that regard, God used the man because he needed to reach out to those people, but not as a vessel unto honor. It is as a vessel unto dishonor. Are you there? Any impact you make on others, any positive impact you make on others while you are in disobedience, you are making it as a vessel unto dishonor. God is using you, but not as an honorable vessel. That's what you must understand. I should get what I'm saying. God told you to travel to a village, stay there for some time so that you can win the souls of the people there. You said no because you you want to stay in the city and enjoy the wealth, enjoy the goodies. Well, while you are in the city too, people will be blessed. You may even be surprised that while you are in the city, you know, a lot of people will be healed. But the question is, you are you are functioning there as a vessel of the dishonor. No, God is the one using you, but not as an honorable vessel. Because that's not where you're supposed to be. So don't let what God is doing through you, don't let it deceive you. Are you where you're supposed to be? Is that the exact thing God told you? Is that the exact thing he told you? Be a missionary. Go on the field. Move from places to places. I will make provision available for you. But you felt your friends, are, they, they, are, they are building their own ministry. Why, why should you be moving around like somebody that is, that is, that is hopeless? So you, you, you discard moving around as a missionary. You chose to build a church and then people are now coming. People are coming and people are sharing testimonies. They are getting blessed. They are growing. Of course, God is using you for them. But just know that he's using you as a vessel unto dishonor because that's not what you are supposed to do. Ask yourself. It's not enough. When I sing, people get blessed. It's fine. Are you doing it as a vessel unto honor? Is that the exact thing you are told to do? Listen to me. Anytime you do something that has the name of God on it, people will be blessed. That's one thing you must understand. So if you are, if you are judging your life by and people are getting blessed, people are sharing testimony, you may be wrong. The question is, am I doing this as a vessel unto honor or as a vessel unto dishonor? The Lord will give us grace in the name of Jesus. This is the wisdom of God. Don't sell it. Vessels. Are you unto honor or dishonor? Make the Lord give us grace to be a vessel unto honor in the name of Jesus.